get ready with me for school okay so i got a haircut yesterday i don't even know if you can tell but i got layers like in the front and then in the back i also got layers i honestly love it but i feel like i wish i would have gotten more off because i feel like you can't even tell that i got a haircut literally had the worst sleep ever last night so i'm so tired today I went to bed at like 11 but i didn't actually go to sleep until like 1 and i woke up at 6 so yeah i also have a history exam today so that's just super fun i tried to study for it but yesterday just wasn't those days where like the information went into my head i feel like history is that one class where i literally do awful in like it's my definitely my worst class not really looking forward to having a whole exam okay also why is life so bad right now like i don't know what it is about life right now but life just isn't like it like it's probably just a combination between the cold weather and then exam season but like life is just so bad okay i shouldn't say life is bad because it's not bad it's just like boring you know i want to use contour so bad but i think that's what's making me break out along my hairline so i'm just gonna put the contour down it's a sad day because i literally look so pale anyways i feel so like preppy with this shirt today i haven't worn it since i got it which i don't know why because it's such a cute shirt but i feel like it's like too preppy i don't know maybe i'm just being dramatic but like it's cute so i'm gonna wear it and it was also really expensive okay i definitely put way too much blush on but we're just gonna blend it out and hope for the best oh crap i look like a tomato i'm honestly just hoping this blush will fade during the day because it's kind of looking like a lot right now Honestly, I don't really understand the whole thing with like loose powders because I feel like I like my pressed powder so much better, but I got this, so I feel like now I need to use it. I feel so pale right now. Okay, I'm just gonna do a tiny bit of contour, a tiny bit. Okay, I just added the tiniest bit and I feel like that just really made me look a lot better. I'm trying to rush because I wanna be able to post this before I go to school because I always post my get ready with me's after school because I just don't have time to edit them, but I'm trying to hurry so I can edit it and post it before school today. Okay, I'm literally so stressed because I have a drive with my driver instructor right after school and then I have to study for my food safe test. Ow, I just clamped on my eyelid. I have to study for my food safe test and then also my science test. So, ow, I keep clamping down my eyelid. Okay, this is so random, but I'm reading this book right now called Never Never. And it's by like that Holleen person. Apparently she's like canceled or something, but her books are so good. Like, I'm sorry. I don't even know what she did because everyone's talking about it, but like I have no idea what is like the drama with her in one of my other videos i talked about how it was literally negative 50 degrees where i live and today it's actually only negative seven so like we're improving here i really want to wear this top but i feel like i'm going to be freezing because i keep our schools so cold like i don't know why but like our schools are always freezing i literally dropped my mascara wand in my hair and now there's mascara in my hair guys this is not what i needed this morning but i feel like it's on the bottom layer so like you really won't be able to tell it's it's fine to be completely honest with you guys i'm just way too lazy to wash it out so it's like you can't really tell okay why do i literally have a ginormous pimple right there that just appeared while i was doing my makeup i swear okay i'm just gonna set my makeup all in place final touches i'm just gonna do my tower 28 lip gloss and yeah that's it for the makeup i'm also going to show you guys my outfit because a lot of you guys asked for like ootds okay here's the outfit i have cargo sweats from garage this is from urban and then i think i might like i don't know i don't know anyways this i don't even know where i got this from christmas and then i don't know where i got my jewelry that's it bye guys hey everyone get in ready with me i shared in my hair this afternoon because there's something super exciting coming up on Thursday. I actually cannot wait. So I wanted to have it streamed for that. And it's also streamed for the Aries so it works out perfectly. Today I obviously had school. And I had English, Math, Legal and Business. So probably like my most boring day at school. I'm getting ready with rings on. I feel like that's possibly the worst thing you could do for your skin. I'm not doing chamomile tea for my skin tonight because... I just can't be bothered. For Taylor Swift, I've been making so many friendship bracelets. It's actually crazy. My back's like getting sore. But I tried making the really complicated ones and it is so difficult. For everyone who can make those really fancy friendship bracelets, props to you because they're actually so much harder than they look. This moisturizer is going to take so long to run out. It'll definitely be expired by the time it runs out. I also ordered my bedding for my room. I asked you guys for like bedding I should get. And I ended up going with the last option, the blue green one. It is just so pretty and like perfect for winter and autumn. But it's coming really, really soon and I just got a new vanity chair. I don't have it like set up yet because I'm going to do it all at once. 
But once it's all done, I'll definitely give you guys a new room tour. I'm actually so excited for it. I just love changing up my room. And especially going to like a new season, I feel like it just makes you actually excited to go into winter and autumn, which I'm normally not that excited for. I'm going to put on this new lip balm I got. It's an MK Beauty Butter Lip Balm in the shade Rose. It literally tastes amazing. It tastes like so clean. I love it. And it keeps my lips hydrated for so long. It's a dupe for the Glossier one. And I've wanted to get my hands on that one for so long. And I'm also going to put on this MK Beauty Lip Shimmer Hydrating Oil. Because why not? These two actually look so pretty together. I use them all the time when I'm like getting ready. This one tastes like a watermelon lollipop. I'm like constantly eating it throughout the day because it tastes so good. But they're seriously the best combo ever. Anyway, I hope you all had an amazing day today. Bye everyone. Hey guys, happy Easter and get ready with me to go to church and then my grandparents' house. I can't believe it's already Easter because it just does not feel like Easter to me. I don't know. It just does not feel like Easter at all. It took me forever to do my hair, but it's finally done. And now it's 9.40 and church is at 10.30. And I mean, I think I'm fine on time, I guess. If I, but I need to be quick. After church, we're immediately going to my grandparents' house. And then we're going to have like lunch over there. It's just going to be like my dad's like his parents and then his brothers and then his cousins and his cousin is my age so i'll hang out with her the entire time i think she's going if she's not going then i'm gonna be upset and then i'm probably gonna stay home just kidding i'm not gonna actually do that okay this dress um i can't remember when i got this but it was like way too big on me a couple years ago and it fits me now i'll show you all at the end my hair looks kind of good today so i'm pretty proud um my halo glow always leaks so i've been like tightening it like way tighter and now it's harder to open i was trying to convince my dad last night to let us swim today but my mom said it was way too cold to go swimming so we can't swim now i'm sad me and my um siblings did like a egg hunt this morning as we always do i got 37 eggs my brother got like triple that i'm like how did you what and then our sister got like really mad and i was just like i'm not here for this yesterday my brother had like a one day easter tournament and so like that made me and my long distance best friend we're gonna see each other we're not long distance anymore because we see each other every other weekend now but anyways we we're hanging out you know catching up in like the morning and then they ended up playing and got second place so we were together till like nine o'clock and we were just getting in that stage where we were just getting getting annoyed with each other and just being so mean there's also like this woodsy area like, there was, like, a trail, like, at the baseball park. And obviously, like, we were invested. So, like, we wanted to walk over there. But then our dad started freaking out. And then we couldn't go. I look like Avery Catherine Wood. Because, like, my eyes are so blue. Me and my best friend were trying to tan yesterday. And then, like, that just did not work. Like, the sun wasn't even out. But it said the UV was 6. I'm like, there's no way. I have to leave really soon. And I haven't even said, or is it my mascara yet? Also, Issa and Juan broke up comment there he seemed kind of relieved so good for him i guess i swear church has been so hot recently and i don't know why ever since like christmas eve mass i'm like what the flip i got two new mascaras for my mom telescopic and my new makeup brushes are coming in today and i'm really excited okay just finished my lashes and i forgot to brush off the powder so let's do that highlighter i need to go it's 10 and here's my fit it's really good that's it goodbye guys happy easter get ready with me for easter sunday 2024 is actually flying by this is the current state of the skin so we got to cover that up how much concealer I can wear without doing foundation because I'm not trying to break out even more. Ow, this one right here is so painful. Accutane was literally useless to me, so that's really awesome. My family's coming over today. We're gonna eat some good food. My mom is cooking. Auntie Pa's ready. I'm so excited. There's my grandpa. <laughs> just ring the doorbell. Like at this point, I might as well just throw on foundation. <laughs> All throughout college, I never came home for Easter. Being back home for grad school has really allowed me to see my family again and just enjoy it because holidays are my favorite thing. Family reunions, get togethers are my favorite thing. We want to wear a dress today and a cute girly floral one, but my entire wardrobe is black.
My entire Easter morning is spent doing my school project. I only have a couple weeks. I present at the end of April, guys. I have to miss two classes this week. You'll see why. But I told my professors everything and they're being super cool. I think I should be fine. And every year, my parents do an Easter egg hunt around the house and my brother and I are so competitive, going around, pushing each other out of the way, trying to get all of it. Is eat or be eaten because my brother and I do not play. The other night at the Color Wow event, there was like a fake casino at the end then you were able to play with all these chips. The top three people at the end with the most amount of money won a prize. I was one of them and I won these freaking Tiffany earrings. Are you kidding me? I've never had anything from Tiffany before. And I get these heart earrings, the little arrow for playing craps for three hours. Like basically I learned I need to go to Las Vegas because <laughs> my sleep schedule is also so off. Like I've been going to bed at three o'clock in the morning. Like, am I okay? I'm getting my nails done tomorrow and I don't know what to get because light pink before this, then the red was a pop of color. I feel like I need neutral again. <laughs> my family is already here and I'm still getting ready. I need to go. I'm obsessed with this lip liner lately. Jones Road. I haven't eaten all day. I'm about to stuff my face. One thing about us Italians is we know how to eat. Now I have to throw on a dress. <laughs> Love you guys so much and happy Easter. Bye. Hi guys, get ready with me to go to the mall with my best friend, or one of my best friends I should say. I'm driving us, so I decided like, I really wanted to do something this Saturday because like I've been doing nothing. Okay, that's a lie. I did something yesterday, but it was really nothing. And I've been wanting to go to the mall, so I invited Romy. Y'all know Romy. If y'all been in my lives and stuff, y'all know her to come and go to the mall with me now nyla our other best friend was supposed to be coming but i don't know what she's doing because she's not texting back or nothing so we might pull up to her house and be like girl what's going on also y'all i got this new necklace it's so cute i like it it's like minimalist but like cute it just like it layers perfectly with this like i wanted something that doesn't take away from the emerald but complements it perfect I feel like my outfit for the mall is so cute. It's this dress with an open back. I love it. I haven't worn it since I bought it because I bought it for my friend's birthday birthday dinner that ended up not happening. I'll say sure we're actually not friends anymore anyways. So guess I'm never wearing it. Um like to her event anyway. So this is it now. Yeah. I always love the way my foundation blends out. It's so cute. Oops, wrong sponge so cute guys little story time okay so the other day i drove myself to school for the first time like by myself right so i parked in the parking lot that's next to school that's like it's like their shops like dollar tree and like burger king and stuff like that so they tow there and my dumb self like i know that but like i'm like no they don't no they don't like they're just lying right and the reason they tell is because my school you have to have a parking pass to park in the school parking lot and not a lot of kids want to pay that even though it's five dollars me personally i want to pay it it's just i didn't have enough time to get it before so i didn't have it you know scratch that i did have enough time to get it before i just didn't so <laughs> Long story short, I go into my first period and I ask my teacher, I'm like, hey, so like, do they tow over there? And she's like, yeah, they do, like for sure. And then like everyone in the class starts to pitch in and is like, yeah, they do. And I'm like, fuck. So I'm like panicking and freaking out. And then I go and lie to my second period teacher and I'm like, hey, like, I left my light on in my car. Can I go turn it off? And then I went to go park in the student parking lot and I got a temporary pass. I got concealer in my eye. We fixed it. End of the makeup look. I love y'all. Bye. Bye. Hey guys, good morning. Get ready with me. I'm in a rush. Sorry. We haven't done a rush get ready with me in ages. And I can prove to you that I don't mean to be in a rush. It's currently half past nine and I have to leave to go to my grandparents' house at 10. Started doing my makeup 35 minutes ago and I got to my fake freckles, ruined my whole makeup. Literally had a mental breakdown and now I'm starting again. Get ready with me for the second time to do my makeup. I'm actually so happy now that I straightened my hair first. Basically, you know everyone always talks about like which order to do your hair, makeup and outfit. And I'm always makeup, hair, outfit kind of gal. But because this jumper, I don't know if you can see the back. Uh, it's literally the cutest thing ever. It's so tight to get on and I knew that if I did it after my makeup I'd just rip all my makeup off. 
So today I've actually reversed the order and done my outfit, hair and then makeup. Well, that was interesting, wasn't it? Glad I bored you with that. Still want to do fake freckles though, so I'm going to do them first and then hope that it, I can do the rest of my makeup over the top. Um, I'm going to my grandparents' house today for Easter Sunday. Oh yeah, happy Easter everybody, if you celebrate. I'm also seeing my cousins as well, like it's a little family gathering. I did do Easter egg hunt yesterday because even at my grown age, I'm still not going to say no to free chocolate. But the weather today, I'm not really getting an Easter vibe, I'm getting a January vibe. I don't know what's going on. Yesterday it was so sunny. I wish yesterday weather was today, like that would have made a lot more sense. I literally have 20 minutes to do my makeup and I decided to do fake freckles. Get a grow. Ah, look at this one. It's fine. Okay, fake freckles done. I'm now going to take them off straight away because I need to move on. Okay, fake freckles done. I 100% need a lighter shade of this because... Okay, anyway, we're moving on. Oh my god, it's 9.40. I have to go in 15 minutes. Oh my god. I'm finally starting to make some plans for my friends over Easter, which I'm so happy about because I was really worried that I just wouldn't get around to it and then the whole Easter would be wasted. It's really hard this time of year to find stuff to do because in the summer it's so easy because everyone just meets up, like goes to a river, like goes to the park. I don't even know. But like this time of year, like what can you even do? I actually can't get over how ugly I look right now. That's not even me being like, oh my god, it looks so ugly. Like, genuinely, I can't even look at myself. This is tragic. I low-key think it's the freckles. Like, the freckles are kind of throwing me off. I'm not gonna lie. Basically, I just don't know how to do makeup when I've got no tan on. Do you get what I mean? Oh yeah, also, let's address elephant in the room. I've got no tan on and I look really ugly. I think that's what it is. Basically, I was gonna tan last night. Like, I've been scrubbing my tan off all week to have a really good tan last night. And then, I don't know why, part of me was just like, oh, I don't need to tan. Like, it'll be fine without. So I did a TikTok and I was like, guys, what do I do? And most people, like, I'm not even joking, like, literally 90% of people said not to tan, so I didn't. But then the thing is, like, no matter how many people tell me that I look better without tan, like, I can't see it. Obviously, all my makeup is, like, the shades when I do have tan on. Like, I'm used to having really dark tan on, so I don't know how to do my makeup now, which is why it's going really bad. I might actually have to finish my makeup in the car at this point because... I'm a little bit stressed. I was thinking like, I'm only going to my grandparents' house, like why would I tan? Do you get what I mean? To be honest, they might not even recognize me because last time they saw me, I had loads of fake tan on and fake lashes. They're gonna be like, who is this? To be fair, my two goals of this year was to stop wearing lashes and stop wearing tan. And I've already done the lashes part. Okay, sorry, I don't know why I'm like deep. I literally just stopped wearing fake lashes. Like it's not that deep, shut up. But like it was deep, but it literally is deep and you don't get it unless you've literally been wearing them for like your whole life. Because I literally, the amount of times I took them off and I'd literally just start crying because I just like, hated myself without them. Baby steps, baby steps. Okay, 10 minutes, let's go, go, go. You know what I'm dreading? Telling my whole family that I haven't got a boyfriend for the 17th year in a row now. I feel like when I was younger, it was kind of like funny, but like now it's like not funny. Like I'm not laughing, it's not funny. Okay, great, now that my face looks partially orange and my neck is pale, literally what do I do in these circumstances? Highlighter, highlighter, highlighter. That's bronzer. Okay, that would have gone well, wouldn't it? Oh my god, my posture. Stop. Hell. You know why I'm so tired? It's because the clocks went back last night. I forgot about that. So I've had one hour less sleep than I thought. Oh dear. Also, guys, obviously I can't do a Sunday reset today because I'll be at my grandparents all day. So I'll do one tomorrow for you. A Monday reset. Sorry, guys, this is such a boring get ready for me. Like, I kind of knew it would be, but I'll do one anyway. So sorry about that. Okay, I literally have three minutes, so I feel like I need to move on now. Finishing off with some setting spray. I'm gonna wash my hands and do my makeup. Here's an up close of my makeup. I'm not loving it, but I'm not hating it, so it's fine. I already know what to do with my hair. Should I just leave it down? Just leave my hair down, and then I'm gonna bring a little hair band in case I decide to put it up. I think I'm actually gonna wear my Tiffany and Co one today. Because I haven't worn this in ages. I literally ration this perfume so much because it's my favourite one ever. And it's obviously very expensive and I don't want to have to rebuy it. Okay guys, here's the fit check. The jumper is from Motel Rocks and look at the back. How cute is that? And then the jeans are from Emil. Guys, that is my get ready for me done. I hope you enjoyed that. I mean, I feel like I'm going to have to go back to tanning soon because today was very, very stressful. Anyway, I hope everyone has a good Sunday whether you celebrate Easter or not. And yeah, I'll see you soon. Bye!
Happy Easter. It is insanely early for me right now. Well, I have a little bit of a situation here. You know how I tell you guys I always stop in and see the dude at the smoke shop and like how we're friends. This is a perfect example of how I literally cannot have a guy friend because they literally always want to hook up with you. I really thought this guy was my buddy and then look what he gave me. A box of chocolates. Yeah, that I already ate. I knew it was too good to be true. Also, I'm like, oh, like I feel bad. Anyway, so today I have to drive all the way back to Jersey. I feel like I don't talk about this enough, but I have my car in the city. It's actually probably the dumbest thing ever. I bought my car in Nashville like 18 months ago. I just love this car so much. I can't get myself to sell it. Honestly, my roommate actually uses my car more than me. But yeah, so I'm going with my mom, my brother, my aunt, uncle, and cousins to the Phillies game today. I'm really hoping that my cousin's girlfriend is going because I'm like obsessed with her. I've never really been friends with anyone my brothers dated. Like, love having this girl around. Oh my god, my mom is pissing me the fuck off. It's early as fuck. I'm gonna be there. She's blowing up my phone being like, why is your location still say New York? Um, because I'm still in New York. And I tell you, 0% of me wants to do this today. I also can't understand that New York is an hour and a half away. She thinks New York, in her head, is three hours from South Jersey. Damn, 10 a.m. and I'm serving look. I've been loving this texture powder from Schwarzkopf. Is that how you say it? So, fun fact, this is a $300 hairbrush. I was gifted it and it's got my name engraved in it and everything. The roommate saw it and she was like, do you know what the fuck that is? I was like, no. I'm gonna make my brother bring me a hat or some shit and we are ready to go. Happy Easter, you guys, for those who celebrate. Okay, I love you guys. Okay, bye.